Hello, guys. How are you? I am here. <laughs> Hello, teacher. Hello. Good evening. Good. Good. So far, so Yes, I just come from my other class. I was running. <laughs> well, um, good evening, everyone. This is our class number 12. Today, we are going to do different activities. We are in the section five, going places. And hello. I think we don't have internet. Oh, the internet is back. Internet failures, <laughs> internet issues. Well, guys, I was telling you, this is class number 12. We are in the section going places. It's Monday, June 12th, 2023. By the end of the class, you will be able to use models for necessity and suggestions. That is something new you are going to learn today. But before we get to the topic, first, we are going to have a review of the previous knowledge. We are going to talk about childhood memories. And we're going to learn about models for necessity and suggestions. <laughs> so right now, uh, you will be working in a small group. And you will talk about you. Tell me about yourself, for example, when where and when were you born? <clears throat> Did you grow up there? Did you have a, do you have a big family? Did you enjoy your childhood? Where did you go to elementary school? Where did you go to high school? So, <clears throat> for example, <clears throat> for this question, For the question where and where you born, <clears throat> where and where, where and when were you born, you will say, <clears throat> how would you answer? <clears throat> how would you answer to this question? And I was born in San Salvador. And when, I don't know. <laughs> Very good. Yes, I was born <coughs> in San that? Salvador. <coughs> I'm sorry. I was born in San Salvador on, in my, uh -huh, on, and then you mentioned the month, the day, and the year. <coughs> I was born in San Salvador on May. Mm -hmm. Very nice. On okay. May. On okay. May. <coughs> and the day. Ahí sería el año, ¿verdad? En el que uno nació. The day. Ah, there's. Oh, May 1st. And the year? <coughs> and the year, Adriana, you don't want to say the year. <laughs> uh, how do you say? 1995. Ah, you see, that's why you need to practice. 90... 1995. Why? 1995, 1995. Okay, good. Now, she was born in San Salvador. I will ask her, Adriana, did you grow up there? Did you grow up in San Salvador? Yes, I grew up, up in San Salvador. You grew up? Um, 
group group up group up mm -hmm. you will say yes yeah. i did okay do you have a big family um no i don't have a, a little family <laughs> only my mom my grandfather and and i and my son okay and you continue with the question did you enjoy your childhood where did you go to elementary school where did you go to high school the other questions were were you a good student in school? When did you first study English? When did you graduate? What was your first year? <coughs> okay. I'm going to send you into breakout rooms, guys, and you will practice this question. I will send you the questions too, okay? So please practice. Give me a moment. In a moment, you will receive the information. Bye. Only two, two you, questions. No, I and and do the next question. Okay. Did you grow up there? Did you? Very mm -hmm. Profesora, teacher, tenemos un teacher. problema de respuesta. You don't find the questions. No puedo escuchar sí. por la pregunta. Ah, ok, use the chat. Use the chat. It's better raining, raining than... It's raining very hard, yes. Mm -hmm. Here is rain, rainy, but in, it's a little. It's raining a little. 
And I'm... <laughs> Don't worry, Jairo. Okay, so and maybe... You look... Sorry? And you, look... and you look bad today. I'm very sick. <laughs> I know. You know what? Yeah. Two weeks ago. Don't cry, teacher. Don't cry, teacher. <laughs> yes. Okay. I will send you somebody else so you can practice okay. with another class. Okay. Okay. And Jairo can answer the questions in the chat. I will write. Hi, Miguel. Hi. Uh, sorry, I was on problems. What are we going to do? Miguel, I sent some questions. You're going to practice ask, oh, okay. answering, okay, okay. asking and answering the questions with your classmates. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, thanks. Okay, uh, um, I'm going to go for some water. Okay, so I'm going to get up. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 Who wanna who wanna practice? Okay. Where and when were you were? Uh I was born in um, Mexicanos. Mexicanos. Uh, I don't know what day, but what's um uh, uh, eighteen no eight uh, of June. Oh, okay. <laughs> what were in San Salvador too? In, in November 7, 20, no, you know, 1973. 1973. Okay. Nubia, you? and you? Oh. Nubia. Okay, don't stay. Give me a minute. Uh, uh, hold on, please. Did you grow out there? Yes, I grew up in San Salvador. Okay. Do you have a big family? Yes, it's uh, a big family. I have a big family. Yeah. When I reunion in the family, there are 15 persons. 50 wow. persons. It's... Another time, all a uh, half. 18, 18, 18 person. <laughs> My family is, is very, very big, big family. Yeah. Do you enjoy your childhood? Yes, and you? Yes, I can say, I can say that. Okay. Where did you go to elementary school? Um. Uh, in I went I went to Colegio Teodor Mons from from Santo Tomas. Ah okay. okay. Where okay, did you I go to high school? Okay. Tell me. I I study in the Acción Cívica Militar. This is for La Constancia. Oh, oh yeah. Me, me voy a salir. Voy a... Ay, no van a grabar. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, if you want, um, in, I, I say you the questions and you answer me. Okay. Um, Can you hear me? Where and when were you born? Okay, do you hear me, Karen? Es que está lloviendo bien fuerte, casi no le escucho. Ok, yeah, yes, sí. Uh, do you hear me now? Where and when were you born? Ok, in this time I will make the questions to you. Ok, ok. 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 Ok, Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. I, I, in my case, I grew up in San Salvador uh, all my life, 
but I changed my for Lourdes Colon for work in the two thousand uh, uh, 90 no I don't know 2099 mm -hmm. okay. 1999 you mean Francisco 19, yes. 1999 okay yes. uh, right now I live here right from 1999 you live mm -hmm. You live in Lourdes since 1999. Ah, uh, uh, yes, since 1999. Very yeah. good. <laughs> uh -huh. Do you have a big family, Luisa? Yes, uh, I have a big family. Yes, what? How, how, how is your family? How big? How big is how your big, family? How big is your family? Pardon? How big is your family? ¿Qué tan grande es? How big is your family? Um, um my parents and four uh, three brothers and one sister. Two brother, one sister, and your father. Uh, mm -hmm. six, six. Okay. Were you a good student in the in high in school? Where you go? Una puede repetir, por favor. Were you you huh? a good student in school? Yes, I did. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Uh -huh, because the question is, were you? Yes, I was because uh, 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 um, no se califica. <laughs> good, uh, good uh, result. Yes. Mm -hmm. When did you first study English? I I was first study English in Academy DPC. I was study in. 2020 science two years. When did you graduate? I don't graduate. I I don't. Eh, the past of uh, don't, Evelyn. The past of Ola? don't. Do you remember the past of don't? Eh, sería, I was... No, no. Do, I did. The past of do is did. In negative, didn't. I didn't graduate. I didn't graduate. Aha, uh -huh. okay. Very nice. Good. <laughs> Continue. What was your first job? Mm, I was my fear jones in station gas exacto oh okay okay no sé si okay. alguien más va a hacer preguntas <laughs> ajá so you were learning more about your classmates Tuve problemas porque como está lloviendo donde le tocaba a mi compañera, se le cayó. Entonces igual como aquí estaba lloviendo súper fuerte, tampoco había mucha interferencia, no la escuchamos, pero logramos hacer el ejercicio una vez. 
Okay, I know it's raining, right? It's raining in many yes. parts of El Salvador. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's raining here, but not so much. That's why I went for my headphones. Yes, but... in, in my house it's raining very hard. Very hard. <laughs> okay. Well, guys, um, we'll continue. Thank you for practicing the questions. Now, uh, this information I'm going to share with you is going to be an assignment, okay? Tomorrow you are going to present, you will talk about childhood memories. You will see an example of this. For example, you can say, <coughs> When I was a child, I used to have a dog named Kaiser. I remember it was a hungry dog. And you can get more information, right? <laughs> As a kid, I used to play with my little sister and my neighbors. We used to play hide and seek, and we used to sing and dance together. We used to sing Britney Spears, Backstreet Boys, and Shakira songs. And you can add more information. This is just an example. And I used to have Barbie dolls. And you can say other toys or other things that you used to have, the things that you used to do with your friends or with your family, the places you used to go, possessions, hobbies, or pets. <coughs> so tomorrow, everybody is going to present uh, this about you will speak for one minute about childhood memories so be ready for tomorrow because you're going to speak about when you were a little kid you were a little child I will send this information in the whatsapp group so that everybody can have it and that can be ready for tomorrow if you want you can include pictures you can prepare a presentation and you can include pictures do you have any questions about this? No, for me. Okay. It's so, it's a, a small what, a paragraph with my child memories, right? Yes, you okay. will. Yeah, you can write it. I put it here written, right? You can write okay. it down. But the most important is what you speak. I want you okay. to speak in the class tomorrow. So you okay. will give a small talk, small presentation about your childhood. Okay? Okay, okay. thanks. Good. Thanks to you. Now, we are going to learn some vocabulary for travel. When you are planning a trip or planning to travel, you make sure you uh, carry with you some things, some objects. So you're going to help me to complete what are the uh, the the objects in their career category: clothing, money, health, documents, and luggage. For example, uh, in clothing, what well, we have here: ATM card, backpack, carry-on bag, cash, credit card, first aid kit hiking boots, medication, passport, plane ticket, sandals, student ID, suitcase, swimsuit, vaccination. So for if I say ATM card, what is the category? Money. Documents. Exactly. Money. Documents. Money. Or, okay. A backpack. Is in luggage. 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 Um, carry on bag. Luggage. 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 Yes. How is the right pronunciation of this, teacher? The last one. Luggage. Yes. Carry on. Luggage. Luggage. Okay. Luggage. Cash. Money. 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 
Credit card. Money. Money. Oh. Okay. First aid kit. Health. 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 Yeah. Health. First aid kit. Hiking boots. Clothing. Clothing. Nothing. Okay. If you're going to hike the volcano, Isalco or Santa Ana, okay. you need hiking boots. Medication? Health. 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 Don't forget your alka <laughs> 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 or your ibuprofen. Aspirin. Uh, aspirin, yes. Passport? Documents. 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 If you're going to travel, <laughs> Don't forget your password. Plane ticket. Document. 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 Uh, sandals. Clothing. If you are going to Surf City, bring your sandals. Student ID. Document. If you are going to Team Marin, bring your student ID. <laughs> Suitcase. Nothing. 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 The first. Your bikini. <laughs> Swimsuit. Fascination. Uh, and health. Yes. For example, uh, during the during the pandemic, you needed to have the vaccines, right? Two vaccinations if you want to go to another country, right? The vaccinations. Or the okay, good. So this is the in the vocabulary. Can you suitcase is for suitcase. excuse me, Margarita? Suitcase is for luggage. Uh yes, yeah. Thank you. I forgot it. Yeah, suitcase. Now it's complete. <laughs> yeah, the suitcase, right? So when you travel to another country, um, that you can uh carry a suitcase and a carry-on bag, right? Usually, if you pay more. You can have more suitcases, <coughs> but you have to pay more, right? Good. But if you're going to the mountains or the beach here in the country, just a backpack is okay. Very nice. <coughs> can you pronounce all the words? Clothing. Loading. 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 Continue. Continue. <laughs> Hi, 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 Sandals. 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 Destination. 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 Passport. Very good. Thank you. Remember first a kit. Yes, Margarita? Uh, how do you say primeros auxilios? Kit de primeros auxilios? First aid kit. First aid, aid kit. Aid. Yes. Thank you. First aid kit. Okay, people. Thank you. We are going to continue with the next slide. Okay. So in this case, we have some paragraph with pieces of advice from experienced travelers. What topic is each person talking about? 
I need six volunteers to read this. <coughs> six volunteers. Number one. Ruth, number two. Francisco, number two. Number three. David, number four. Karen, number five. <coughs> Nubia, and number six. One more, <clears throat> Margarita, okay. You can start, please. Okay, you should tell the driver where you're going before you get off, and you have to have an exact chance for the fare. You should try some of the local society that is better about, about to be still on the street. When you fly, after Francisco, quien iba después de Francisco. David, number three. Yes. Yes. Uh, when you fly, you should keep important things in your carrying bag, such as your medication and credit cards. You shouldn't pack them in your checked luggage. In most countries, you don't have to have a international driver's list license. But you must have a listen from license. your license. Okay. But you must have a license from your own country. You also need to be 21 or over. You are you all to pack a first eye kit and any medication you need, you shouldn't drink water from the type from the tape. Sorry, you ought to keep a copy of your credit card numbers at the hotel, and you shouldn't carry a lot of cash when you go out. Okay, so what is the topic each person is talking about? What is, what topic is each person talking about? What do you think is the topic? Travel. 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 Okay, when you travel and? When you travel to another country and... Uh, you must uh, move in, in the city or something like that. Okay, nice. Thank you, Margarita. So they are suggestions, suggestions um, and warnings. Because when you go to another place, you don't know how the people are, right? So you need to know and you need to ask. Or you need to listen to the people's pieces of advice or suggestions they give to you. For example, um, I like, this is very important. You shouldn't drink water from the tap. It's like from, right? Maybe the, the water from the tap is contaminated or polluted. So you shouldn't drink water from that. Or... Um, or this one, you should tell the driver where you are going before you get on. If you are going to take a taxi, you have to have exact change for the fur. Because if you don't have the exact change, they won't give you the change. <laughs> so um, 
they are suggestions, right? So if you notice in this um, paragraphs in this text, you can find the structure. For example, here we have, you should tell the driver where they're going before the ground. And you have to have. The second, you should try, but you better. You better. So you imagine, better. imagine a friend from another country, from United States, Canada, or Italy, France, comes to El Salvador for the first time. So you you can tell him, yeah, you should try some pupusas. But you'd better avoid the pupusas from the street, right? <laughs> because they can give you stomachache or diarrhea. So you should avoid the stalls or the people um, cells on the street. Okay, so you should try, you'd better. Another one. When you fly, you should keep. Should, should keep. keep. Uh -huh. You shouldn't pack. Uh, don't have to. Don't have, have to. To have. You don't have to have. But you must have. You also need to be. Need to be. Need to. You ought to pack. You shouldn't drink. drink. You ought to keep. You shouldn't okay. carry. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we are going to study this structure more in detail in the next slide. Models for necessity and suggestions. <coughs> okay, for necessity, we use you have to, have to, must, need to, and don't have to. You have to get a passport, it's a necessity. You must get a visa for some countries, Mexico, United States, for example. You need to take money, a lot of money. <laughs> for some countries, you don't have to get any vaccinations. Don't have to. So it's not necessary. Okay, so these are the models for necessity. Have to, must, need to, and don't have to. <coughs> For giving suggestions, you can use have better, of to, should, and shouldn't. Examples, you had better talk to your father. You ought to go with someone. You should take warm clothes because it's very cold in Alaska. You shouldn't go by yourself. It's a dangerous country or it's a dangerous city. <coughs> okay, so those are the models for the models for suggestion. Now, what is the structure? If you notice here, the structure for models. You are going to help me. First, we need a subject. Then, the model. Then, the verb. In base form. Okay, don't forget. 
and complement. So that is the structure. Subject, the modal, have to, pero va junto, miren, have to, goes together. Need to, don't have to, of to. So subject, the modal, the verb in base form and complement, okay? I know you're sleepy and it's raining. <laughs> okay. I will I will give you some exercise so you can wake up. <laughs> Good. So we have more examples here. Examples from the text. Must need to have to and don't have to. Models for necessity. Do must have. It's an obligation. It's very necessary. You must have health insurance. You need to be 21 or over. You have to get a passport. You don't have to get vaccinations. Model verb for suggestion. How better? You'd better avoid the stalls on the street. Do you have to make a copy of your passport? You should try some local specialties. And you shouldn't carry a lot of cash. Okay, and now, help me to match the signs to the rules. You must not walk on the grass. You must not walk on the grass. C, letter C, letter C exactly, letter C. letter C. You must not take photos. Letter A. Letter A. You must not use your cell phone. Letter D. You must not turn if the light is red. B. Letter B. B. Letter exactly. B. Exactly. Very nice. Now choose the best advice for someone who is going on vacation. Okay, think about it and help me. You can use have to or had better. You have, you have, you have, you have, you have, you have, it's necessary, right? Have you have to make hotel reservations in advance. It might be difficult to find a room after you get here. Number two. You you should carry the identification with your with your is allowed. allowed. Okay, should. must is a necessity. Should is a suggestion. Uh, uh, must okay. it's a must. Exactly. You must carry. You must carry identification with you. It's the law. Okay. Number three. By you should oh, you buy should buy around trip. It's a suggestion. It's a suggestion. You should buy a round trip plane ticket because it's cheaper. Okay, number four. Don't have shouldn't should should you don't have Student. 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 You shouldn't pack too many clothes. You shouldn't pack too many clothes. You won't have room to bring back any gifts. So it's a suggestion, right? Don't you shouldn't pack too many clothes and things because uh you won't have a space. Or you won't have room to bring things, right, from the place you are going to visit. <coughs> oh, you are asking for the pronunciation. Up, up, up to, up, up, up to. <laughs> okay, number five. You check out of most hotel rooms by noon if you don't want to pay for another night. 
Necessary or suggestion? Up to. Up to. Up to. Up to. Suggestion. Well, it's, it sounds more like a necessity, something that you must do. No. Okay, you need to. Mm -hmm. You need to check out of most hotel rooms by noon if you don't want to pay for another night. Mm -hmm. And finally, you buy a new suitcase because your old one is getting shabby. <laughs> off to. Off to. Off to, exactly. Off to. Off to. That's correct. Excuse me. Okay, so um very nice. Good way. Let's go to the next exercise. So imagine you're going to travel abroad. You have to give advice. <coughs> For example, you must get the necessary vaccinations. Number two. What would you use here? You need to, you have yeah. to, you ought to, you should. You need to. You should. You, you should. You should. You should. Okay. You should. Number three. You must. Huh? Have to. Okay. Let's say. Or it's it sounds more like a, um. A suggestion, right? You have to. Oh. Because it might get you the sounds. And number four. Oh. <laughs> oh, yes. You don't have to. You don't have to. You don't have to forget to pack your camera. And number five. Yeah. Number five. Short, short, short. Well, it's not a suggestion. Need to. You Need have to. a visa to enter some foreign countries. I don't know. If maybe Should. need. Must. You need to. Right? You need to have a visa to enter some foreign okay. country. And the last, you have change to. money before you go. No. Have to. Okay. You have to change money before you go. You can do it when you arrive. Excellent. Okay, now imagine somebody... <coughs> A friend is coming to El Salvador. It's the first time this person is going to visit El Salvador. This person is from Europe. So you have to give him or her some advice. He or she wants to visit San Salvador City the downtown San Salvador, the beaches, the mountains, the volcanoes. So what pieces of advice would you give to this person? Type in the chat, okay? <coughs> Type in the chat.
I'm sorry, I wasn't speaking with the microphone off. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm reading your your piece of advice. You have to bring summer clothes. Yes, because El Salvador is very hot. Some blocker and umbrella. You need to have your tourist visa to go to the bank. Actually, um, I think you don't need a tourist visa to come to El Salvador. But you need your passport. You need your passport. Or do you need your tourist visa? I don't think. Some countries need, for some countries, you need to have visa. Countries like Mexico, like United States. But... For Central America, I only need to do it. Exactly, your ID. You need your identification. <laughs> okay, but imagine this person is coming to El Salvador. You have to tell your friends some suggestions. Things that he or she needs to do. For example, I would tell my friend, you have to learn some Salvadorian vocabulary or Salvadorian expressions. Right? You have to learn some Salvadorian expressions. You should try You should try pupusas for los planes. If you want to travel more comfortable, you should rent a car. Very nice. <laughs> you have to try a tall shuko. <laughs> well, Jenny wrote it as a necessity. <coughs> Remember, must is for necessity. Need to, have to, and don't have to. Suggestion had better of to, should, and shouldn't. You have to return to Sabbath on vacation. Okay. Okay, Adriana wrote an example that is real. You have, you need to learn another language to get a good job. You should learn to transport yourself by Salvadorian bus. You have to eat yuca for typical food. Actually, I think El Salvador is one of the countries who, that is very safe for its foreigners, for people from other countries, right? Okay. Thank you for your examples. <coughs> one more. <coughs> 
Oh, interesting. <laughs> okay. Well, it's time, guys, to take the attendance. I haven't taken the attendance, so please say present or here when I mention your name. Adriana Gonzalez. Present. Ana Silvia Rodriguez. I'm here. Blanca Benavides. Here, teacher. Blanca Margarita Guevara. Presente. Brian Present. Hi Sorry. <laughs> Brian Escobar, <coughs> David Mejía, present, Esaú Tobar, present teacher, Evelyn Marroquín, present teacher, Francisco Villafuerte, Glendy Flores, present, Giselle Marie, Iris Janet Martínez. Isaura Evelia Vázquez. Present teacher. Ah, ok. Jairo Naamán. Josué Miguel Portillo. Present. Karen Bernal. Present teacher. Karen Iber. <coughs> Kenia, Karen Iber. Kenia Vanessa. Present teacher. Leslie Victoria. Present teacher. Luisa Ariana. Present. Mayra Patricia. Nerlin Jaciel. Hello, present teacher. Okay. Nin Rob Saúl. Present. Nubia Cristina. Present. Oscar Alexander. Oscar. Renato Salvador Ramírez. Present. Ruth Noemi Beltrán. Present. Jenny Carolina Ardó. Jenny Carolina, she disappeared. <laughs> oh, she's there. Okay, so guys, um, what did you learn in this class today? What did you learn today? About models for necessity and su suggestions exactly what are the models for necessity models for necessity a ver david do you remember, David? Um, must, should. Mo necessity, should. must, have to, need to. Should. Need to. Yes. And for suggestion? Should. Should, should. up to, exactly. Mm -hmm. Very good. And what is the homework? Is to speak about the childhood. The childhood memories, yes. And today in the first activity, you practice the simple past when talking about the past, your, your life in the past. Okay, thank you for connecting to the class. I hope to see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.